Somewhere in the deserted winterland of Minnesota, a secret conclave of secret messengers has secretly gathered at the Gathering Hearts Chapel, which is also known by its secret name, the Church of Holy Smoke. I am here at the Church of Holy Smoke with Canabius the 42nd, the impressive clergyman of Florin. The conclave has already started, considering whether Bill Maher's life merits canonization. They are considering making him a saint. Your exalted smokiness, how is this possible? I thought that one could only become a saint if they lived and died in such a holy and exalted way that he or she is worthy to be recognized as a saint. But Bill, as holy as he may be, is still alive. Well, the recognition of sanctity implies that the person is now in heavenly glory. And as we all know, Bill is, more often than not, high in heavenly glory. Uh, still, should he have performed two miracles? Sure, he has. First, he got a politician to tell the truth. Running this country. It worries me that people are running my country who think, who believe in a talking snake. Um, you don't have to pass an IQ test to be in the Senate, though. <laughs> and then he got a Catholic priest to tell the truth. We have been talking to so many religious people, and many of them believe the Earth is 5,000 years old. If you're a scientist, you can't accept that. Hey, Reverend, you got some funny smoke coming out of your chimney. Hallelujah! Long live St. Mar! No way! Actually, they chose him to be the patron saint of the Church of Holy Smoke. I present our patron saint, Bill Moore. Ha, 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 ha.